Hi, I'm David Davis from Actual Tech Media. We're here at the headquarters of Weka IO, and I'm proud to be joined by Mr. Richard Dyke. How you doing, Richard? I'm doing great today. How you doing? Great, great. So thanks for joining us. Uh, I want to learn more about Weka IO. I sat down with the founder um, at Amazon reInvent last year, uh, got a really great briefing, and but the company has made some tremendous advancements. You, you all have grown a lot since then. So, you know, first, why don't you just tell us who is Weka IO? What problem do you solve? No problem. Um, so Weka IO is an all software uh, product that uh, basically is a file system, a shared file system. Uh, it's fully POSIX compliant. Um, and so we basically are the fastest file system on the planet. So the problem that we solve is if you're IO starved, we can serve up IO and take care of that challenge. Okay. So I'm sure there's some companies out there that have some applications that are just dying for, for more data, for more I.O., for less latency. Uh, can you give us some use cases? What, what type of apps need Weka I.O.? Oh, absolutely. So there's been a, you know, a, 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 an awful lot of machine learning applications and a lot of A.I. Um, you know, obviously HPC is very important. Um, and over the years, that's been the most demanding environments for you know, uh, high performance compute. But what you're seeing today is that you know, it's very commonplace in the commercial industry. They just, it's changed to be AI and machine learning, right? You're, anybody's out there um, trying to train data um, and do, say, autonomous cars or autonomous trucks or um, autonomous boats. I mean, there's an awful lot of you know, uh, interaction that you need to be able to, in scenarios that you have to be able to figure out. So you have a pipeline of data that has an awful lot of information that you're trying to stage, and then you're trying to clean that data, and then in the pipeline you usually have a GPU cluster uh, with the data scientists kind of going after and attacking the training of that data, that's the intelligence of it, so that it can think for itself in the you know, difficult situations. Um, that's probably the most I.O. intensive application that we see, um, and w an area that we've done very well in, and so we see a lot of traction in that space. Okay, okay. Yeah. So let's say that I'm an IT administrator, I have an application like you talked about there, one of those applications that needs massive amounts of data throughput. Does this, does this file system run on-premises? Does it run in the cloud? It runs on-prem and in the cloud. Um, so actually, Weka I was born in the cloud from a GA perspective. We did all our GA in uh, AWS. So we had a real world kind of environment as we kind of hardened this product as we came to market. Um, as you know, it takes a while to build a file system, and uh, we've been you know, GA for almost a year now, and uh, we've announced a huge uh, relationship with HPE. Uh, so we're you know, supported globally um, and sold globally through them. But if you're an administrator, you can you know, uh, use this um, on-site or in the cloud. Okay. Um, and it's you know, very seamless, actually. Okay, so if somebody wanted to try it out as a proof of concept uh, in AWS, I'm sure that would be kind of the easiest place to get started, no hardware required. Yep. How do they get started? So you're actually able to go to start.weka.io, okay. and uh, you can go right to that website, and you can start to go through this formation template, um, and you can pick the requirements that you need for I.O. and for uh, throughput, and over on the right-hand side will come up different options within AWS for you to um, select from, and it would vary in price and you know hardware configurations. And then you basically go through that template, and it auto-formulates, -form and then you're kind of up and running in the cloud. It's pretty simple. And we can be found on the AWS Marketplace. Okay, so start.weka.io. Correct. And, I mean, the great thing I love about that is for a proof of concept, you can try out the fastest file system on the planet for you know, probably a few bucks exactly. um, in AWS you know, EC2 expenses there. Um, and then if you decide to go into production, you could just upgrade the instance sizes in AWS. Yep. And, and massively scale out. It's uh, highly elastic, so you can you know, scale the um, uh, infrastructure you know, pretty seamlessly. Excellent. Yeah. Well, thanks for your time today, Rich. All right, thank you. Appreciate it.